I want to tell you a story. It's the story of an old man who used to visit a young man working at a job. Every time he'd visit that young man, he would hear stories from the young man about all the great things that he wanted to do. That young man didn't believe he'd be at that job forever, and the old man believed him. Every time the old man went to the store and didn't see the young man, he thought to himself, that young man must have moved on and found that better job and is doing that better thing. They didn't see each other for a while. And then one day, they saw each other again at a different store. It turns out the young man followed up on his promise. He had wandered off into the world and found great jobs, seen a many things, and done great things. The old man was happy to see him again, but also sad. Because every time the old man would visit the young man, the young man would ask the old man how his wife was. And the old man loved to share stories of all the fun things they would do and all the adventures that they would go on. But this time, the old man's wife was gone. You could see the sadness in his eyes, having to think about that loss. So the young man gave the old man his number and asked him to call him the next day so they could meet for lunch to talk again, to spend time with each other like they did once before. But the young man never heard from that old man again. I was that young man. I miss you, my old man. The lesson here is that you do not ever know how much time you truly have. And that you should treat each moment precious. Not spend it filled with complaints, but spend your days filled with all the joys and adventures that you want to go on.